Hey there gamers, welcome to my gaming world. Today's video is about Game Face, how I get it working, how suggestions basically if, if you're struggling getting it working. I know a lot of you get to the stage where it says generate Game Face, game face I mean, and it doesn't do it. You know, you, that little bar that says generate is all greyed out and you know, you know straight away when as soon as you look at it, you'll click it anyway, but you're thinking, the bastard's not gonna work, is it? Fuck. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's very frustrating. So, the thing is, I've just got an ordinary computer. It's an AMD graphics card. I don't know if that's got anything to do with it, but it's uh, an i5 processor, uh, an Intel i5 processor, um, and it's running the latest um, graphics driver for AMD, AMD Radeon. Yeah. So, if you've got AMD, I don't know if it's an issue, if you've got Nvidia, I don't know if that's an issue with this game face thing not working for people. But if you go on the the website now, I've I've already created uh, my account and uh, linked it to my PSN account, mm -hmm. two of them anyway. But my main one, Pemby sixty six, I'm not linked, and I've, I don't know what to do to get it linked. It's just it's just a load of messing about. But anyway, when once you're on this page, you go to services, game face. Now, my game face is already because I've got the. Um, when you first go into it, it'll give you the option to download the um, the plugin, the game face plugin, and make sure. One thing you have to make sure is the latest version of the game face plugin. Plus, you have the Unity Web Player, and you also have to download that, and make sure that's the latest one. Plus, the actual Firefox browser, which is the only one I found it works when, is the latest edition of Firefox. You know. If you go on Firefox website, just um, downloaded it, and if it turns around and says you are already have the latest version installed, then uh, you know obviously about it. Don't worry about it. But this button here, go to Add-ons. Now you notice Game Face plugin, Shockwave Flash pay Player, and the Unity Player. Unity Player always activate. Always activate the Shockwave. And always activate Game Face plugin. Make sure these are checked. You know, the, if it says never activate, you know, you got a problem. That's might be one of your problems. I'm hoping it's as simple as that. You know, hoping this video basically can help a lot of people. Uh, let's X out all that. Going off. Okay. Hello, Mike Jar sixty six. Bit of a Jar fan. I don't know if you younger versions. Young, first younger version, younger g gamers out there know know the brilliant Frenchman Jean Michel Jarre. I'm a big fan, hence my avatar on my gaming channel from one of his albums. Anyway, start with Game Face. Right now, this is what I see. I try, I try to create Kratos <laughs> from from God of War, and it's not exactly turned out very well. But um. Another thing is if your your account, what you can see here, make sure you're logged in on that account on your PlayStation 4 or your Xbox One, you know. Because otherwise, you know, you won't be able to download the game face because the two aren't linked, you know what I mean? Um, let's actually, let's go, click on start, click the trash can, click the photo, generate photo. There we have Floyd Mayweather. I've just shared this image on the Floyd Mayweather 2.0 video. So if you've watched that video, go back to it and you'll see a link now to that photograph. As long as you uh, credit me when your creation, you know, thanks to Pemby66, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> and that's, it's, it's all cool, you know what I mean? Right, let's choose this photo and continue. Next, next, next. Now I've already done it. I've already centered him and got the all the markers in place. But look, notice how I've done that. I've made sure all his eyebrows are on there. You know, most of his cheeks, but make sure the bottom of there coincides with the bottom of his chin. Right? Sometimes you find some fighters, some players, sorry, uh, characters you want to can create for the game. The nose gets all fucked up no matter what you do. And I've had that problem with Chris Eubank. You know, I've got folk, great photographs of him, but. <laughs> the nose just gets all balls up and I don't know why but anyway this is my Floyd Mayweather next 
Now you can mess about the saturation if you want. You're making black and white if you want. You can do that, but that then it'll look, if you did that, it'll look ridiculous in the game, and you won't be able to change it. My advice to anybody is why this image is lighter than normal. Let's just let's just pull that back to not. Go back to not. Don't just jump back one when I fucking <laughs> move me underway. Brightness. Now you have him dark like that. Then you you know you're asking for trouble. Too too light. It's not it's it's not really a problem, but you're losing a bit of detail. So you know I, I that's for me this image is is just about right because when I import him into the game, I can then use the tattooed shapes to cover his whole body in black and then reduce the opacity so he he goes more to a natural brown skin tone that you used to see him seeing him in reality you know. So that's a tip I can give anybody. Make sure you're a fighter, especially a coloured fighter or a white fighter or a Chinese fighter. Make make sure that the skin tone is lighter and then you can manipulate the skin tone when you get in the game because the skin tone, for f fuck knows reason why, is disabled when you import your game face, which I think is bloody ridiculous. And I've said it before. But anyway, you notice all the different ones are all nicely represented and should be where they should be. Next. Now, I could click yes here, but I'm not going to bother because I've done it before. This is just for demonstration purposes. Generate game face. Now, you know what? I can interact with it there. If you've got to this stage and you've got that problem, then like I say, check those add-ons. You know, game face, game face plugin and the Unity player. You know, make sure things are activated. Or always activate. And if you've still got problems there, then I'm, I apologise. I really don't know what to say. I really don't know what to suggest. But we'll go through all the little things that I've said. Make sure everything's up to date. You know, it should work. Let's generate a game face. And while we're doing that, let's have a look at some of the... Some of my creations. New fighters. Now, if you want to see Ben fight Nigel Ben... Uh, Nigel Ben. Uh, Chris Eubank, then let me know. Here's Nigel Ben. I don't know, the video seems to freeze there. Let's just minimise it a little bit. There we go. Nigel Ben, the Dart Destroyer. Very famous boxer from the 1990s. Famous for boxing against this guy. Now, I don't think he's turned out as well as Ben's turned out, but it's still pretty decent. We've got Adrian Broner. You've got to see him fight Floyd Mayweather. In the mini league with Miguel Cotto, Amir Khan, um, Oscar De La Hoya. You just let me know and I'll, I'll post the videos. We've got some great fights recorded. You can either have him with a beard, which is, if you watched all of that video, he's, he's got a beard at the end of it, you know, just, just that as an alternative. I like this one, me. You couldn't say that's anybody else, could you? Unless you know somebody that looks exactly like that, and you say, "No, it's not Miss Gelcott. So it's my mate who lives in the <laughs> lives downstairs." <laughs> it's Miguel Cotto. great boxer in his time. Let's have a look at uh, Andre Ward. Now, getting hold of a good photograph of him was hard, and I'm not 100% pleased with this version of him, but you know, it looks like him. I say it does anyway. But anyway, let's X that off. There we go. Generation complete. <laughs> See what I mean? Kratos. It was like... It was like, more like fuck knows. There we go. Floyd Mayweather. Now, you can see that the side of the face, you can manipulate the side of the face a lot in um, game, the game face on the game itself. So I find if you mess about it too much on here, then it balls it totally up but that's how easy it is to create a fighter and just remember the tips remember the things that I say and if you're still having problems then I have to do some research and see if I can help I'm gonna go through the forums now and all, all the different places I can think of to go to find out reasons why some people can't get this working 
and I just hope what I've said helps. All right. So thanks for watching, guys, and really appreciate the support I've got lately for my UFC videos. I'm not a competitive gamer, you know. I'm, friends of mine, Relapse, Sakuraba, the great players at this game, and the um, they play online, but especially Relapse, he gets so stressed, and I'm thinking. Gaming should not make you stressed out. Gaming is an escape, you know. It's pure escapism. It's there to be enjoyed, you know, with your friends or on your own. All right? Anyway, hopefully that's helped somebody. Helps a lot of people, actually. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.